Saint Louis de Marillac Saint Louis de Marillac, also known as Saint Louis, was a remarkable woman whose life exemplified devotion, compassion, and service to others. Born on 12th August 1591 in Lemieux, France, she was the illegitimate daughter of Louis de Marillac and his wife, Louise de Marillac. Her early life was marked by hardship and uncertainty, as she lost her father at a young age and faced financial difficulties. Despite her challenging circumstances, Louise received an excellent education, thanks to her mother's determination and the support of relatives. She excelled academically and developed a deep spiritual devotion from a young age. This foundation would shape her future endeavors profoundly. At the age of 22, Louise married Antoine Legras, a secretary to the Queen of France. Despite their difference in social status, theirs was a happy and supportive marriage. They had one son, Michel, who brought great joy to their lives. However, tragedy struck when Antoine fell ill and passed away, leaving Louise widowed at the age of 27. This loss proved to be a turning point in Louise's life. She turned to her faith for solace and guidance, becoming even more deeply committed to serving those in need. Her encounter with St. Francis de Sales, a renowned spiritual director, was instrumental in shaping her future path. Under his guidance, she discovered her calling to devote herself entirely to serving the poor and marginalized. In 1633, Louise co-founded the Daughters of Charity along with St. Vincent de Paul, a priest known for his dedication to serving the poor. The Daughters of Charity were a community of women who took woes of poverty, chastity, obedience, and service to the poor. They dedicated themselves to various charitable works, including caring for the sick, educating young girls, and assisting the impoverished. Louis' leadership and organizational skills were instrumental in the rapid growth and success of the Daughters of Charity. She established hospitals, orphanages, and schools throughout France, providing essential services to those in need. Her compassionate nature and tireless dedication earned her the admiration and respect of many, including members of the royal court and clergy. Despite facing numerous challenges and setbacks, including war, famine, and persecution, Louise remained steadfast in her commitment to serving others. Her unwavering faith and selflessness inspired countless individuals to join her in her mission of love and compassion. Louise de Marillac's legacy continues to inspire people around the world today. She was canonized as a saint by the Catholic Church in 1934, recognizing her exceptional virtues and contributions to society. Her life serves as a powerful reminder of the transformative power of love, compassion, and service to others. May we all strive to follow in her footsteps and make a positive difference in the world.